Hi, I'm Ben Bankowitz. Welcome back to TCM's Evening of Family Classics, made using the Cinerama process, celebrating its 70th anniversary this year. Both of these Cinerama features we have tonight are from 1962, so this is their 60th anniversary. During the 1950s, movies were going head-to-head -head with television, and they battled for the entertainment dollars of millions of Americans. Movie studio executives and theater owners were convinced TV could mean the end of their business, and they weren't wrong to be afraid either. Movie studios lost roughly 70% of their profits between 1946 and 1952. Television was the main culprit. Hollywood responded by making bigger movies, epics, adventures, sweeping period romances, the kind of grand stories you couldn't get at home on your 19-inch Zenith Chesterton console TV. MGM's The Wonderful World of the Brothers Grimm from 1962 was shot to be projected in Cinerama, a widescreen process that projected images simultaneously from three different projectors onto a huge curved screen. The first Cinerama films were mostly elaborate documentaries and travelogues shot specifically to showcase the technology. By the 1960s, though, MGM was looking for narrative feature films to produce in the new process. We just had the meticulous 4K restoration of the wonderful world of the Brothers Grimm. Up next, we've got the TCM premiere of a 40-minute documentary about the film's extensive restoration. It's from 2021, Rescuing a Fantasy Classic. Directed by Harrison Engel, this is a well-paced, deep dive into how Cinerama restoration specialists David Strohmeyer and Tom March worked miracles. The original 1962 Cinerama materials on the Brothers Grimm were long considered hopelessly faded, water damaged, and therefore unsalvageable. Strohmeyer, March, and their team used state-of-the-art digital tools to join the three panels used in Cinerama seamlessly. Each panel, of course, had different degrees of fading, so careful scanning and digital color correction was needed to make them match. The Multi-channel audio was remixed to 5.1 stereo. Even some flaws in the original film were fixed by the team. No matter your level of expertise in film restoration, this short doc will dazzle movie lovers because it really celebrates what other movie lovers are capable of accomplishing. From 2021, here's Rescuing a Fantasy Classic. David Strohmeyer and his team spent a year and a half restoring the wonderful world of the Brothers Grimm. When it first appeared in theaters in 1962, it was one of the first narrative movies ever exhibited in Cinerama. By using three different projectors all synced together, the film was projected onto a huge screen that curved around much of the audience. It was the IMAX of its day, but surely felt like a much bigger deal. It's harder today for technology to dazzle us. We expect it. For moviegoers, attending the roadshow engagement of the wonderful world of the Brothers Grimm was an event with reserved seating and printed programs. Audiences often dressed in their Sunday best. Coming up, we've got another Cinerama classic from 1962. A restored version of How the West Was Won is next on Turner Classic Movies.